all everyone thank you so much for watching this video this video is all about gajakeshri yoga one of the prominent raja yoga in vedic astrology so what are the planets associated to form this gajakeshri yoga is what i'll be discussing today there are two important and auspicious planets which forms a very good dhana yoga which forms a very good raja yoga in vedic astrology they are jupiter and moon okay some people also debate that venus and moon also is considered as a gajakeshri yoga so first of all what is this gajakeshri yoga gajakeshri yoga is one of the dhana yoga one of the raja yoga that can be formed depending upon the planetary alignment in your birth chart if at all jupiter is placed in the sagittarius as an example i'm saying and the moon is placed in the pisces that means four houses apart from jupiter okay or seven houses apart from jupiter or nine houses apart from jupiter then that is considered as gajakeshri yoga let's say sagittarius let's say jupiter is in sagittarius zodiac sign and moon is placed in pisces zodiac sign or gemini zodiac sign or leo zodiac sign then that is considered as gajakeshri yoga there is a conjunction happening um depending upon the 1 4 7 and 9 series uh, gajakeshri yoga is formed generally from jupiter and moon if at all you have jupiter plus moon combination that is even more fantastic if at all you have jupiter plus moon uh, placed in one zodiac sign of your birth chart that is also considered as gajakeshri yoga in fact that is gajakeshri yoga and if at all jupiter is aspecting on moon from the seventh aspect and moon is aspecting to jupiter to each other mutually aspecting to each other obviously any planet in the birth charts from its place will be aspecting to the seventh house and the vice versa so if at all both are seeing each other in your birth chart jupiter and the moon then forms a gajakeshri yoga so what are the effects of this gajakeshri yoga this makes the person very intelligent this makes the person very knowledgeable very good communicator okay he will be attracted he will be able to influence large large uh, audience okay he will be super wealthy and at the same time he will be having lot of people working under him okay and uh, most importantly he will become a great scholar okay he's become a great educationist people will be recognized will be able to recognize his knowledge and wisdom okay why because jupiter is the planet of academics jupiter is the planet of wealth jupiter is a uh, karaka for development jupiter is the karaka for wisdom knowledge creativity innovation and moon is the karaka for gains moon is the karaka for wealth flow wealth accumulation prosperity abundance okay moon is the karaka for your thought process moon is the karaka for your mind so this combination makes you very good um, you know a great astrologer okay a great scientist a great advocate a great doctor okay something to do with research and development so you will be excel in these areas very well you, you might become a great it professional you might become a great manager you might acquire leadership first of all any rajyoga that you have you will be able to get into the you know you, you might become a business owner you might uh, get into a very good role in your company all these things generally happens if at all you have a very good rajyoga in your birth chart okay so all these things has to be carefully analyzed to see that whether you have a rajyoga that is not none other than one of the great uh, one of the prominent and uh, popular raj yoga which is nothing but gajakeshri yoga there are 200 other raj yogas that i'll be discussing in this youtube channel in my forthcoming videos so this is one of the raj yoga which i'm explaining in fact if you refer to my past videos in my youtube channel there are more raj yogas which i would have discussed okay so i hope you can watch that videos also and get knowledge out of it and if at all you want to know that whether this combination is there in your birth chart also if at all you want to learn your birth chart if at all you want to uh, get the reading done by me on your birth chart if at all you want a consultation from me the link is mentioned in the description section do book for an astrological consultation once i get a consultation order that will enable me to check your birth chart to sit on your birth chart for hours to get there and i can able to analyze your birth chart by providing you the final predictions pertaining to your birth chart okay so please book for an astrological consultation please like share and subscribe to my youtube channel if at all you haven't subscribed till now because you'll be missing the great updates on my astrology um, uh, videos i'm sure you're loving this and i'll see you in the next video bye for now